Hey everyone, it's Zero Beliefs, and welcome back to State of Decay, where right now we have to go save Ethan. He's in trouble, and our new guy here, a cop, he's gonna go save him. Alright, off we go. Come on, man, you need to move a little bit faster. Yeah, he's a little bit hurt, but he should be fine. I hope so, anyway. Alright, we'll take the truck again. Let's get a move on. I'm on the move. Yeah, I decided to let them join. They're really not too bad. Yeah, I've yet to see any more. If they would report them to me, that would be great, but I know that I'll probably have to go look for them. Not that I want to. I mean, if they pop up, sure, but I need to, or a lot of problems can crop up if you let them just kind of run wild. Don't worry, Ethan. I'm on my way, man. I know that these zombies will come towards my truck, though. Oh, shit. Okay, here, here we go. Hold on. He's not too bad, though. I mean, he's cracking some heads open. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's attach that. Good. Okay. I got these assholes. Do you? Good. Let's get shot these tools then. Awesome. Man. Who needed help? Me or him? <laughs> I like the handguns, so. They're really fun to use. Oh, where's the other bastard? Here he is. Yeah, I'm gonna train up this guy too, and the other chick is a powerhouse, which is awesome, which means that we'll let him be, become good at a melee you weapon. Got that one. Nice. That's the last of them. Alright, do I need to take you home, or what's up? I guess I don't. Okay. Trust gained. Nice. Alright, we don't have any, any other missions right now. I think about that. No, we don't. Just her buddy who's headed. Wow. Oh, no, that's Virginia. Wow, it took her a long time to get home. It's not doing too hot, huh? I could go on some hunts. I really want to find out where that fucking infestation is, huh? Hold on, I might. Oh, fuck. Don't hit my truck, damn it. Hold on, I have to get out of here real quick. Really need to explore some more homes, though. That way I can get some more influence. I'm kind of running a little bit low. I mean, I'm doing enough to keep it up, but still. I always want a little bit more. Okay, let's see. I need to go and find... I've always surveyed from up there, so I need to go somewhere else. Maybe a little bit further down. I hear a lot over here, though. Okay, let's see. Where's the survey point? And, uh, right here. I've already looked at that one. Need to go for one that's a little bit further, though. Alright, I'll try to find one. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff out here. I would love to clear out this area. If I put up a new outpost, I would have less room. Oh, that's a little bit frightening. Lunged at me, man. Creeps me out. Yeah, we've got a lot of vehicles out here. Nice ones. Alright, let's go cruise around for a little while. I wonder if the infestations are up at the camp. That would suck. It's so far away. Right, we don't want to lose our truck. That would put us in a bad predicament. Alright, so we don't have a location to survey over here. So clearly, they're not in my town. What's that sound? It can't just be the zombies. Okay. There's a survey point there. I don't want to use that one, though. I don't trust that. Got it by Virginia. Good work. What's that damn sound? Seriously. I, I mean, it's the truck, but still. Like, what in the truck is going wrong? <laughs> Alright. Trust over there. Trust over here. Desperate survivors. No one has any missions for me. I guess we'll head back to town. Way up there. And check things out. And maybe we'll find it. And if we do, I'll have to get some help for that. He's a new guy. He's not going to go in there alone. It's crazy. I mean, he does have a suppressor, but what, only two? We'll have to make every headshot count. Okay, let's go find something to wreck. Well, not not my truck. We have found my truck, but I don't want to wreck that. We get to go by the aircraft. I do want to go there, but the fields, man, they get wicked. Every time I go out there, or almost every time I go out there, there's a large amount of things, Zeds, that we have to kill. There's a nice little water supply over there. This place has a lot of natural beauty that you really probably wouldn't find in most locations like this. Could go after the Wilkerson's and check out their bullets. I can always use more. But I'll pick my time. That's another large group. Gosh. I feel like it's just getting more and more as I do more of the story quests. That's why I've been training up people so much. I hope I don't lose any of my survivors, so as I go out, I'll be very sad about that. I mean, if I kill them, that's one thing. I know they're gonna die, but... 
Ooh. They're killed and it's not on purpose. I mean, clearly the zombies will kill them on purpose, but if it's by accident on my end where I'm not safe enough, then I'm a little bit sad. Truck, just stay safe, please. We'll just slow down a little bit when we get to the town so that I can hopefully quietly do what I need to do. Check it out. Because I need to clear out any infestations. I wonder if I can just bombard it if it would go through the house. I doubt it. I don't want to use up all that influence in case it doesn't. Ah, uh, no, I know. You're pissed at me. Blah, 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 blah. Goes to zombie board. Oh, shit. Okay. This should be a little bit more quiet. There's a truck there, right? Yeah. I, I could take that one. It's probably a lot less damage. I don't think I have a red truck. I'm pretty sure that's a red truck, too. <laughs> How important these things are to me, the color of my vehicles. Red truck, black truck. Alright. There's some survivors, I'm pretty certain. Yeah, right? Yeah. They've got some medical stuff. Let's go talk to talk with them. See what they have in their supply lockers. Maybe it'll let them kill these zombies. <laughs> Let's see. Point forty. Yeah, they don't have a lot of good stuff here at all. Let's see. Take those though. Thank you. Where is everyone at? They should have people here. Weirds me out when they don't. No zombies going towards my truck, also weird. It's strangely quiet out here. Yeah, I guess they're in a different room in there. They're not all dead, they shouldn't be, otherwise that wouldn't be an enclave. Alright, I haven't been in this town for quite some time. I'm really thinking they're up at the fucking camp, but I do not want to get back there. Okay, let's try to keep it quiet. Just trying to keep it quiet. I feel like they're not loading in or something because <laughs> I don't think we're seeing anything in this town. It, it usually does take them a little bit to load, but not this long. I think I hear one in the restaurant though. Okay. And up we go. We haven't been here for a long time. No missions yet either. <sighs> what do you people want me to do, huh? I feel like I heard one. Probably. Alright, up we go. Boom, 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 boom. Now we're working this guy. Oh, I need I to use some quit food. making him run. Okay. Time to take a look around. It's a juggernaut. Have I seen a ju wait, that's not a big one. It's a juggernaut, yeah. Are they the same thing? I don't know. I mean, no, they're not because they have There's different names, but still. There's a freak. There's certainly a few freaks here, yeah. What's over here? I got a horde over here. Yeah. Any infestation? No, it's that, a horde too. Uh, that's a lot of zombies. Yeah, there's no damn infestations in this fucking town. <sighs> Alright. Let's go, buddy boy. Home we go. Whoop. That still looks hilarious. Looks like you've been doing your yoga, man. Stretching out like that. Whoop. Okay, let's go out of here. Maybe go explore a new location back in town. In Marshall, we're done with this damn town. I, f I know that I didn't loot all the stuff here, but... Oh, shit. There we go. Come on. There we go, come on, come on. And we're good. Three more shots. I just want him to get better with his damn handgun. Plenty of those types of bullets to spare. Okay, we have desperate survivors over there. They have food. I don't want their food. We have construction supplies over here in this location. That's pretty cool. I might go take that. No, I don't want your damn fuel. I want your construction supplies. We'll probably go that way and take it home. Hey, there's a lot of them over here. Yeah, I really wonder what's going to happen next, like with the army or whatever, because we still haven't opened up that new area. If they do, I'm considering about moving there if there's a large enough hey, location. I just got a report from ah, here, here. Folks outside here, we go, here we go. Couldn't get a lot out of them, but they sounded scared. Might be worth checking out. Great. Great, great. There's probably some freaky zombie, and I'm not I'm bringing on a powerful Keep an person eye out there. The there's a lot out there. Yeah, you, you tell me these things. I'm not 
like going up to the damn camp. I could though now, but I would need someone to follow me. If someone has a mission, then I'll bring them out there and we'll go. We'll spend a day going to go check it out, but for now, let's just, let's just go check this out. Excuse me. I want that new truck, to be honest. <laughs> I'll just keep mine for now. I like to try to preserve what I have. Now what's spooking you, man? I don't like driving this far. More neighbors? Wait, wait, we have two in one location? Weird. Oh, 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 I see you, Screamer. I see you. Now I don't. Okay, some more zombies in here. Yeah, so we have... I already oh, told you, we don't oh, have any ammo. I mean, Christ, we're already down to killing zombies with two by fours. Yeah, that's real heartbreaking. Thing is, that doesn't change our bottom line. Who the fuck but are I these don't guys? have any. I'm not interested in your excuses. You got two days. Oh, and in case you were wondering, we do have ammo. Fucking bastards. How about I kill both of you? Seems like we missed an opportunity. Perfect. The hell was I thinking? <sighs> Everything okay? I can take the bullets. Yeah, I got that impression. Come on, follow me. I, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> hey, you do have some bullets, so I think you lied, but... Let's take the bastard home. That's what spooked them? <laughs> okay. Humans? That's that's what spooked you? Is he the only one here, or what's up? Is he in my truck? Yeah, okay, cool. We're about to get out of here, then. I guess I could head to the fields if I wanted to. A bit like that, yeah. Alright. Let's gonna move on. I'll try to carefully move through this area. I should probably try to... Oh, shit. Yeah, we just need to try not to hit trees that much or we will ruin our trunk. Like that. <laughs> Alright. So we can follow this road back home. There's a lot that I haven't scavenged yet. It's just that if I can make more use of a party, then I would feel a bit more prone to doing so. But I guess if they let you bring more people all the time, then that would be an issue too. But there's so many supplies that I can still use. Right, so I'll give them some stuff. A little ticket home. I, I don't want to lose all these bullets, but I mean, guy needs some help. I would rather go kill the people who are threatening him. That's fucked up, man. I can't stand pe uh, people like that. Well, like, oh, we're in our own little clique. Let's just, you know, ride it out. Try to profit from the suffering of other people. It's just called business. Hey, fucking bastards. Bitches, I swear. One day I'll put a cap in all Oh, oh, by the way, in case you're wondering, who do you have? shut the hell up. Do it. There's a screamer, too. He's all screaming. Yeah, his fucking handgun is awesome, though. Very accurate for headshots. I like it a lot. I'll have to make sure I give some of the other folks some of this stuff. I could have given him a revolver, which would be completely impractical. Fuck. It's my damn truck. Shit. Alright, we'll see if we can... I'll leave it and maybe they can repair it. I doubt it, but if, but if they can't, I would love that so much. I'll have to look it up if they can do that. That would be awesome. I just don't think they can. I think you need like a higher workshop, but hopefully I am wrong. I don't want to be right in this case. Oops. Keep fucking up. Alright. Alright, buddy. Give me all of these freaking bullets. You better be thankful. <sighs> Big inside him. Yeah. Yo, people. Giving up some stuff of ours. Please don't be too pissed, huh? Alright. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Yeah, they're they're gonna be mad. I'm pretty certain. Come on, you're carrying this. This is uh, wow. This is a lot of ammo. What were you planning to do with this? Just follow me, and stay close. I'd rather you didn't get eaten. Yeah, uh, I guess. We're getting six cases from our training though, so that's pretty cool. But we need to go now. All right, where are we going? Back to where he's from. Oh, we're going to the... Wait, the Wilkerson's? Were they the ones? Oh... I guess we'll take the nice car. I can always get a new one. Come on, buddy. Go in there in style. Oh, he's like, ah, this isn't too bad. I got 
pretty much shaken up by some fools, and now I can take a nice car home. Alright, let's go bring these guys, i bring this guy home. Or not home, but to the Wilkerson's. I probably should try, try to shake him up some more. Appeasing these guys is not the way to go about it. I can, un I can understand the reluctance to go to a confrontation with those guys, but still, because they're, they're probably experienced, but we have 20 survivors. But I always feel like whenever you have more people, that always tends to go back anyway, unless it's the bad guys, and for some reason their numbers matter a little bit more. No, they, they tend to lose a lot too. I'm just talking to what I read and watch in shows or comics or whatever. Well, not so much comics, but the graphic novel of The Walking Dead, which I've read quite a bit of. Alright. Quick ride there, huh? Pretty nice. I know he's happy about it. He's like, yeah, I'm not getting my ass beat again. So, there's two groups of survivors <laughs> right there. Desperate people, desperate strangers. Right? I guess at least we know a group of more strangers and not just people, huh? That's weird, though. They're in their own groups, yet one's in the barn, one's not. Sounds like they'll be going to war soon. One second. Okay. Let's just go now. Almost there. I love these cars. They're very nice for quick runs like this when I know that. Or, yeah, when I know that there might not be more people to take. I would hate it if I had to leave my car behind. Alright, let's just hurry up now. I guess I'll keep taking the roads there because I did damage my truck and I don't think it was in the field. There's another nice one right there. I wonder what cars I've not seen. I, I'm guessing this is it, but maybe it's not. Alright, almost there. Almost, almost, almost there. Yeah, my base is pretty much self-sufficient. I need to get rid of a few people. I might. I'm still thinking about it. We killed one off, but there's some that I still need to kill off. I mean, it's just how it has to go. I have to keep the useful ones. I mean, some I don't want to kill just because they've been with us for a long time, so I feel really bad, but still. <laughs> like Virginia Dahlgren, I mean, I, I do make jokes about the flag, but I just, when they've been with us for a long time, and I've seen them, and they like stand out in my mind for whatever reason that I tend to like, but now I like this cop. I mean, yeah, he's a autocrat, so people tend to not like him for that, but I mean, seems to be pretty cool. As long as he did the, doesn't try to lead the men, he's all good. That's for Marcus and Ethan, surprisingly. I can picture them being uh, best friends since Ed's gone. Off himself, bastard, left Marcus all alone. What a place to go out to. This is scary. Right, you bastards. I'm up. Oh shit, I'm fucking dark. Alright. Hope I didn't. didn't anything. There's a zombie right here. Guess they don't care that much. Better get ready. We'll be on them soon if we keep going this way. Oh yeah? Well, that's one gone. Oh shit, there's a screamer. Okay, that's, that's a fucking problem. Hold on. Oh, they're killing a few of the bastards too. Alright, I'll take out this one for now. Hold on. I'm trying to slowly move my analog stick to get a headshot. Damn it. That did not work out. Yeah, there's one. He's coming right for someone. Them. We need to take care of that screamer, though. Yeah, it's right there. I fucking see it. Shit. Alright, I need to get my suppressor on. Alright. Boom. There we go. That was a bit scary. I was hoping not to have any issues with that okay here and what the hell is this it's the rest of the ammo you rode that should clear the debt well you boys didn't have a bullet to your name this is from your stock isn't it <laughs> don't be an idiot why would it be from their stock does it clear the debt or not yeah bullets are bullets don't much care where they came from you can tell your sweethearts their debt's settled the hell'd you do that for I, I, I don't even know what to say. Thank you. Doesn't really cover it, does it? Really? Forget no. it. You'd have done the same for us. No, you, uh, yeah, I guess. Oh, shit. You couldn't really have known that. Shit, shit, shit. Shit. Alright, let's take out these fuckers. Old school. Damn. 
Nice work, man. Not bad for. I got nothing left. Yes. Oh. Getting close though. He's doing really well. I guess y'all heard my damn car. There we go. Alright. Do I need to no, I don't think I need to take him home, surprisingly. Alright, let's get in our nice car and leave. That's right. We're like the daddy war bugs here, baby. Daddy zombie bugs, I don't know. Oh shit. Put the fuck up my car again. Alright, loss of hope. I don't know why we're doing well. More people, look. In the context of this uh, in the context of th this situation, do not think of what was prior. Think of what is now. And in the context of what we're going through now, we're doing well. We're doing very well. We have a home. We are self-sufficient. We have a lot of people. We have the capability to care for our own. I mean, it's just, there's so much good going on in what could be much, always much worse. I cannot really support that notion of this losing hope. I can't go anywhere without running into horns. Well, we have traps, baby, baby doll, so I mean, we'll be alright. Like that, see? All good. Oh, there's a lot of fucking cars that won't lie about that. Yeah, if cars need a gas, we'd be in a little bit of a problem. And I also know they took out the generators for the fuel. I guess they just kind of want to make it a little bit easier, but I mean, I guess in this case it is really easy. I don't really run out of much. Of course, what I, I would probably do is have less people, a smaller base, yet or just more stuff, and just be able to last for a longer period of time because you have less people consuming your stuff. But with that, less room that you have, you can't have like things like a dojo or whatever. It turns out it's really that useful. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, the farm I don't think would be too bad. It's like, it's in the middle of pretty much everything you go do, but... I don't know, it's probably much worse than I'm thinking, unless there's like a road that leads to it. I think that's where the farm is, maybe? I'm not certain, but it might be here. Now, if there were some more roads that led to the other side, it would be a really good base, just because that would that would diminish how much you would run into trees or whatever. Like that. <laughs> I don't think I would do that. So we go and open my door. No, I'll stay in safety of my car, thank you. He's pretty happy. That's Marshall. Bypass that. Going down the other bridge. Here comes us. Here comes me. Yeah, I really like this guy. This, this guy, Christopher Chris or whatever. He's really great. Really solid at shooting. I mean, he has two traits that lead to him increasing his shooting skill immensely so. So he's going to be really good. I think I'm here. Oh, uh, just hope there's no bigger there. Duly noted. Alright, let me get down there. Hold on. Don't want to draw too much. Alright. Let me get out the car. Oh, it's a fucking... We're clear. Hold on. Let me take out this bastard. Try to, anyway. <laughs> Boom. Level 3 shooting. Side. Oh, he is. That's scary. Yo, buddy. Can anybody hear me? Oh, thank God. George. Come on, we're getting out of here. <laughs> He's awfully like tall. Guess I've taken up enough of your time already. Let's get out of here. You damn well have, son. Nah, George. It's it's cool, man. Come on. These guys are idiots. I guess they meant to add more homes, or they will add more homes. I really can't wait to see what they'll do in the DLC. With a sandbox mode, I'll be able to do a long-running series on this, and that would be fucking sweet. I love that. Alright, well, we actually made it through our night fairly well. I mean, we, we lived, we prospered, we... <laughs> just did pretty well. I need to let that car match up a little bit. Okay. You got it from here? Thanks. We got it from here. Good, good, good. Thanks. Thought I was dead. Yeah, man, it's all good. Miss her. All right, we have our gun. We have our baton. She had his gear still, but he doesn't have his gear. All right. I 
think we're pretty good to go. There's Karen, who I don't use. He's good at a lot of stuff. Machete, fighting, shooting. He's really good at shooting. Wits, cardio, da da. Played golf. <laughs> Improved cardio, believe it or not. <laughs> the daydreamer, funeral director. So he's a good leader and decent at everything else. He's spiteful. I don't know why. Fuck you. Alright, there's Virginia Dahlgren. I'm considering helping her out. I don't know yet. I might give her a revolver, but she, she doesn't have a skill. At least things that I wanted to have skills at. It's Carly. She's good at being a powerhouse, so... Surprisingly. She's a tough chick. Yeah. Alright. Did she serve or something? I don't think so, no. Guard duty. I want to hear more about their histories, but they haven't really spoken much about that. Loved cycling. Oh, wait, what? I just saw something real quick. What was that? Like a good neighbor. All is quiet with the Wilgersons. <sighs> that's not too bad, I guess. <laughs> we appreciate you as a neighbor. Well, that's nice. Right, let's go check out what she has going on for her. I might need to go get some supplies eventually. 9mm, we'll put that up. Since that I'll give her a, re a revolver, I think that'll be pretty fun. Let's see, 0.45. What else he uses that? 0.40, I'm already using that up. 9 millimeter, 7.62, 0 0.44, 0 0.22, a snub special, 0 0.45, okay, revolver. Last days of World War One. <laughs> Let's see, revolver, 29. Accuracy on this thing is better, though. From, I think it is anyway, it's just as loud. Alright, 0.44. Only four bullets, though, yeah. Let me see, 0.45. Ah, we we'll, we'll, we could just take this then. Yeah. All right. I hope that we can take these bullets though. Let's see where are they at. Do do do. Right here. Cool. That won't work. All right. We'll take these with us. She has her meds. She has most of her stuff that she needs. She needs a melee weapon though. Let's see. I could give her a heavy weapon. She's a powerhouse. So does that. That's a blunt weapon. Edge weapon. I'll have to think about what I'm going to give her. Let's see, a lot, a lot of blunt weapons. Let's see, edged, heavy. We already did the edge stuff, so I want to give her a blunt weapon. <laughs> Here's a wrench. Too small. Fancy machete, that's nice. A pry bar. Oh, that scared me. I was like, who the fuck? A hoe. Crowbar. Yeah. I'll take the damn crowbar. That will last for quite some time. Yeah, she's not too bad. Doesn't really have a shooting skill, but just trying to get the guys all together, you know? Whoa, foggy. Kind of, kind of creepy, to be honest. Not sure how I feel about that. Okay, what missions? Oh, they want me to lure in the Zed? What do we have besides that? Not really too much. Alright, well, I shall see all of you later, and as always, until then.